See how long it takes people to show up. <laughs> I know with the NFL draft and all that. All right, seven people. Man, you guys got nothing to do. <laughs> what up, Facebook land? I'll say hi to all of you on here. Just wanted to jump on real quick. As you can see, I've got this beautiful, gorgeous, sexy, fill in the blank, whatever word fits for you, Sonar SQ2 Custom, made for yours truly. Been waiting forever. We won't delve into that part. Any, like any good thing, any good thing is worth waiting for. <laughs> enough with the comic relief um the whole point of this video is uh as you can tell uh we are about to move to our new house so this gorgeous kit even though i barely had it a week will be boxed up after today i finished my last session i have no work and uh, we close next week so i wanted to give you guys a little quick live demo i just shot the demo that i'm going to upload to youtube but uh why not give the folks something uh little bit live here again this is this is not a demonstration of skill this is just a demonstration of the kit a uh, little details behind the kit this is again a custom S sonar sq2 which is the sonar brand flagship um, basically you think of it they'll build it um, specifics on this kit right here this is a 100 percent birch drum kit um, this is a 8, 10, 12, 14, 16 toms, uh, 16, uh, 22 kick, 13 snare. Uh, depths are 8 by 7, 10 by 8, 12 by 8, 14 by 13, and 16 by 15. The kick is a little bit shallower, which I actually found out is made the kick actually deeper. But nonetheless, it's a 16 by 22, so only 16 inches deep. That's how I used to, used to playing in 18, so. And the snare is a 13 by six and a half. This is my first actually 13 by six and a half. So it's quite lovely. And uh, another thing that's unique to <coughs> Sonar is you can actually tell them how thick you want the, the, the shells to be. So if you can tell from the video here, you look at the lower, the higher racks, the 8, 10, 12, you see that shell, it's way thicker compared to the, the floors there to the right. Uh, in sonar land, that's called uh, heavy shells. So the A1012 are heavy shells. The floor toms are thin shells. I did that on purpose. Uh, my thought process was more mass equals uh, less stick attack and more of the wood tone of the drum. And quite the opposite on the floor. So the thin shell, less mass, more, more room to vibrate. So you get more stick attack, but also you get loads of sustain and resonance. So uh, I'll do a quick demonstration and then... Uh, I'll be signing off here to go watch the draft. Nonetheless, here we go. Again, this is just a demonstration of the kit, not of skill.
there you have it. Sonar SQ2.